Hello guys, it's your boy Mr. Swag right here, and we are back in another video, and we're about to go ahead and talk about Dragon Ball Super because we did this once on our video just talking about Dragon Ball Super. I wanna I wanna do that a couple of times, and uh yeah. So sorry I've been missing a couple of days or actually a couple of weeks, but it doesn't matter. Cause you know, cause you know, you boy got school, we got freaking stuff, and you know, I'm not gonna, cause I'm gonna try to make videos, but it's it's not gonna be maybe a lot, cause you know, like during the summer and stuff, you know, I used to make like a bunch of videos, like the the whole entire, all my whole entire channel is all about videos in the summer. So now I got school, I'm not gonna be uploading like I used to be. Maybe same for like Beast Mode, cause he didn't upload like in like I don't know, I think it's been like a month, but. I want to talk about just you know just Dragon Ball Super. How's it been going? And uh, we got this dope music. Hold on, turn it up. Alright, so, yeah, I want to talk about Dragon Ball Super, how's it been going? Uh, the last time I did this, I think it was, like, Black, it was, um, Future Trunks series. But, uh, yeah, so I want to talk about Dragon Ball Super so far. So, basically, in, right now, I don't, wait, has 112 came out yet? Where's my phone? Oh, it's right here. I want to, I, I want to see episodes 12 out, but... So we got, so we got, um, we got Goku, we got, why say that so little Goku? Oh, uh, we got Goku, my homie Goku. I know him in real life too, if you guys didn't know. Uh, we did a picture on Instagram. I'm just kidding. But, um, yeah, so, so, uh, uh turn this off, turn this off. Alright, so, hold up, Dragon Ball 112. So 112 didn't come out yet. I'm just checking. Wait, yes it did. Ooh, okay. You guys may want to check that out unless you already did. So I just wanted to see if that was out. I'm about to watch that. So, um, so we got Goku and we got Jiren. Jiren, the Jiren. I want to say like in Japanese how that's Jiren Sen, Jiren Sen, Goku Sen. All right, whatever. So we got Goku and Jiren. They fighting. We got Goku in this in this Ultra Instant and. This was my opinion on the ultra on the ultra. Oh my god, I can't even say it, bro. Southern ultra instinct. All right, this is my opinion. So, I I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Hold on, be, before I go there, hold on. I want to say this part. You know what's really funny? I'm not even laughing though, but it's funny because everybody keeps saying, "Oh, his new transformation is gonna be like." Like Super Saiyan God with like Kyle Ken like times fifty or something. We got freaking like it, cause a lot of people. My hair is messed. No, it's not. It, it usually is like that. So usually, um, people say he's gonna master Kyle Ken with like Super Saiyan God or something. I don't know, but but also I just want to say that it's funny because. He changed the transformation because everybody in the comments is like, "Oh, I thought his transformation was like master, like he was gonna master Kyle Ken with like Kyle Ken times fifty, and that's gonna be his max or something." But it's funny because he changed it and he changed it to a new form that nobody even knows. Like after the soon I looked at it, I mean the soon I looked at my first, my first uh, thing in my head was Super Saiyan White. That's the first thing because you know. We got freaking Goku mad. We got the white aura around him. So I thought it was Super Saiyan white. But no, it's just, it's this form with white aura, but like regular hair. And he's glowing a little bit. So basically, it's like, basically, it's like a potential unleash. Basically, that's what it looks like potential unleash. But it looks better. But, and, and, uh, I will, and we're gonna see this in episode 12, I think. But I'm trying to see why the gods were so surprised when Goku turned to Ultra Instinct. Cause we got freaking the even the angels. I mean, there's some of them were. I mean, Whis was like, "Oh my God, Goku is so amazing." So, um, 
I think if Goku masters that, if Goku mastered that level, I think he could beat any guy of destruction because everybody was so surprised. Like, if they're gonna like, we got the freaking um the clown. I I don't even know everybody's guy of destruction's name, but we got the clown one. He's just grabbing his head like, oh my god, Jordan's gonna lose. So I think that um he's at least strong. Like, he can at least match up to Beerus, so, like, he may have to, may Beerus have to use the full power because when Goku was versus Beerus, he was doing the 70%. But I think Beerus is going to have to use his 100% if he went against Goku. But, I think, yeah, but, that's, that's why I have to say with that Ocean Instinct, because I think that's stronger than a God of Destruction. But, don't let me get started with this boy, Jiren, though. Alright, we got freaking Ultra, Ultra Instinct, bruh, going against German. We got freaking Super Saiyan God times times 20. And German is not even trying, bruh. This dude's something, something. Like, he got this bare hand. He just stopping that punch. Just staring like, how can anybody like German be that strong? How, how can somebody like Goku be that strong for real, for real? But, like, he's a freaking, he just a regular class saying. He went to freaking Kaioken, and then he, and then a bunch of years later, we got freaking Ultra Instinct, bruh. And why, why do I have a feeling that Ultra Instinct is not in his last transformation? Like, this dude is gonna go be on and on and on no matter what. Cause we had Kaioken, then his max was like Kaioken times four, and then we went to Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan 2, Super Saiyan 3. And then we got regular God. He knows how to use it now, so he can just transform it. I don't get it because I don't get it. Hold on, I'm gonna say that level because we'll focus on Jern. But how can someone as strong as Jern be like that strong, bro? And I don't. You guys may think I'm crazy. Like you guys may think I'm really crazy or something. But I don't think Jern is the God. Like, cause you remember last time they were talking about this uh. There's a mortal, some there's a mortal, or there's a person out there that even Beerus can't defeat. I I don't think it's Jiren. I don't think I don't like because Jiren, even though he's strong, he defeated the Spirit Bomb and everything. I don't think he's still even that strong. Like to be honest, like he is, he is max. Like like okay, how I can say this is he's really strong versus everybody, but in the real real, he is not that strong, bro. Like, I don't think he could defeat a god of destruction. I mean, even if he can, I don't think he's the person. I don't think he's the person because he could have, if that was, I feel like he'll be a thousand times stronger. Like, I, th I think Jiren would be able to, I think, like, okay, so how can I put this? Wait, but did he say, I don't know if I'm, I'm, I'm hearing things, but did he say, like, the strongest guy that even can't even defeat Beerus, they can't be in the tournament? I, I thought that somebody said that, like, freaking Beerus or Whis or something like you can't or he was in a universe that that universe can't even go to, to um to the to the tournament of power but all I got to say is I don't think Jern is the guy that they said that he he could defeat even Beerus the god destruction can't even handle I don't think Jern is the one and uh I'm gonna react to the video even though I already watched it but I really want to upload my channel if you're a Dragon Ball Super fan. Because they said that the angels are evil. Like Whis, Dados. And I believe him because he makes a good point. Because I watch all these videos, 10 facts you know about Vegeta. Freaking secret things about Dragon Ball Super and stuff. I watch those because it makes so sense. Like you want to believe it. So I'm going to react to I don't know when. I watch it be like freaking like 5 weeks later. I don't know, but I'm gonna react to that on my channel. Why the or you look it up on YouTube unless you don't want to see my reaction. Or I already watched it, but I want you guys to watch it. So, so uh, it's called. It's, just look up like uh, the angels are evil, and he makes a good point. I just want to let you know they could be evil, especially that one angel, the one that smiled. I don't think he cared, cause I mean I wouldn't care either because. Okay, this this would be my reaction though if I was him. I wouldn't be that. I would I would smile too maybe because they're a disgrace. All right, they lost. Those the first one to like to be um 
you know, those are the first ones to get out. So I wouldn't even care anymore. Like, I'd be like, oh, that's you guys' fault because you guys should have at least got, like, third or fifth place. But come on, the first one out? Bye-bye, suck. Bye-bye, sucker, lucker. All right, no, don't, don't do that. Don't, don't. No. What? No. No. All right. So, that's what I got to say. And... It's weird because I watched this video about Drama Super. This dude talking about the top 15 or 10 people that can defeat Zeno. And the in the last one, or not, not like the least, like the the lowest one that can defeat Zeno is Kappa. Kappa? Wait, is it Kappa or Kappa? It's Kappa. You know, Kappa, the one that the, the fight on um, Vegeta. I was like, bro, if you don't get out of here, talking about you guys think my, think I'm crazy? Nah, stop. Just pause the video right there. You are crazy. Kaba can't even defeat Vegeta, bro. Like, but yeah, and you you can't. Okay, this is what I want to say about Freezer though, bro. You can't tell me that Freezer tricked you twice, bro. He tricked me twice. One because Freezer versus Gohan on the Tournament of Power, he tricked me once. Especially the one when he teleported Goku to heal him. But, I mean, he actually did. But he got me scared. But I thought he was going to blast him off the freaking tournament. If I was Beerus, I wouldn't even care if I got freaking, um, I wouldn't even care if I got eliminated, uh, like, erased. I would have went up there and trying to, uh, trying to erase Frieza. Because, nah, bro. So... So basically, we got it. We got hit out. We're about to have Goku. He can, he's trying to figure out how to master this power, and Goku is our last hope. I just want to say, Goku is our last hope of beating Jiren. Without Goku, Jiren is gonna win. He could be the only one in the haunt. Like it could be like everybody. Versus Jiren and what? Watch Jiren still win. It's gonna be Jiren's like Goku, and everybody else is just, is gonna be like Avengers. Like it's gonna be like a bunch of just people just trying to defeat Jiren. They all gonna get out. See, this is my free bro. What is that girl's name? Ryber Anna, Ryber Anna, something with the one with the love. Like you know what I'm talking about though. She got like the love. She got the love power. She's like fat and she's like a girl and uh, she's fighting with Vegeta. She been in the tournament for like how many episodes? And you know how many times she, she fought Goku. She and then they're gonna just stop fighting. Then they fight Android 17. Oh, they stop fighting. And then she finally fights Vegeta. And then they stop fighting. Like, like, but so many people went went up against her, but would not eliminate her. Like it's so freaking stupid, man. Just hurry up and eliminate her. She needs to get out the episode, please. <sighs> Uh, I think that's all I can say, other than Jiren was somehow he still, he still, he can still defeat Goku, even with Ultra Instinct, like, that's crazy, bro. Like, but Goku, he did look cool, though, like, that, that dude has so much swag when he freaking, with that spirit bomb power, but... This is my question. I'm not in the video, but this is my question. If Goku can turn Super Saiyan Blue with Kaioken, would it make sense if he can turn Super Saiyan with Kaioken? I mean, don't. I mean, if you put in the comments of your opinion, because if he could turn Super Saiyan God with Kaioken, that should mean that he could turn Super Saiyan with Kaioken. Like, because they're both transformations. And if you really think about it, though, Kaioken is weak. I mean, it may upgrade your speed and stuff, but it's still weak. Mm -hmm. Going against, like, how you gonna mix a weak transformation with a powerful transformation like God? Like, I mean, if you really think about it, you can say Kaioken times 100. I don't care. Like, how is that gonna, how is that gonna boost you if you got a low transformation like Kaioken? Like, because Kaioken is, like, right here, and this is God right here, bro. All the way up here. And then he uses Kaioken with the God. Like... Is that not like how is that gonna make him stronger? I, I'm just saying, but if it doesn't make it doesn't make sense though if he could turn Super Saiyan with Kyle Ken though, because the because Super Saiyan and Super Saiyan guys is is the same transformations. I don't know. That's my 
reasoning right there. I'm gonna do more of these, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe, dab on that like button. Thanks for watching my videos and subscribing. We're almost to 100 subscribers. Let's get there in the past until Halloween. And yeah, have a swag day. Stay being cool, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, swag kids.